Hey everyone, here I am doing exercise 10.1, 17th question. This is the last question of this exercise and this is menstruation chapter of class 6 and the question here is Avneet buys 9 square paving slabs each with a side of half meter. He lays them in a the form of a square. So we have given a picture over here. What is the perimeter of this arrangement? They are talking about the first question. We have to find out the perimeter of the first arrangement which is in a shape of square. Now they have given that each slab is of a half meter. Half is nothing but 0 0.5 meter. Yeah. So each slab is of 0 0.5 meter. First we have to find out the perimeter of the given arrangement, the first one. Now here you can see this is half. Each slab is of half, not side of the square. Each slab is 0 0.5 meter. So this is 0 0.5. This is 0 0.5. The next one is 0 0.5 and the next one is 0 0.5 so if you look here 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 this will become 1.5 so here the three slabs when you put on this side this will become 1.5 meter I'm talking about one side of the square here after putting three slabs and we know that all the th all the other side will also be a 1.5 this will also be a 1.5 and this will also be 1.5 so perimeter will become so, and the shape is of square so perimeter is equal to 4 into side so 4 into side means 4 into 1.5 so 4 into 1.5 is nothing but 6 6 meter so we got 6 meter for the first question the next one here is Shari does not like his arrangement. She gets him to lay them out look like a cross, the second figure. What is the perimeter of her arrangement? So we have to find out the perimeter of the second image. Now here if you see, I am going to keep adding. This is 0 0.5 and 0 0.5 which will become 1. So this side is 1. This side is also 1. This side is 1. This side is also 1. I am just writing the 1 which are 1. This is also 1 this is also one I hope you understood how we got one because two slabs when you put here 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 will become one so that is how we got one so I'm gonna add up directly here so this whole side is of one so one plus this side whole will become one then plus this is 0 0.5 because one slab is of 0 0.5 meter so plus 0 0.5 the next this length is again 1 plus 1 this uh, this side is 1 again so plus 1 the next this will become 0 0.5 so plus 0 0.5 now this side is again 1 because two slabs are there again two slabs are there so this will become again plus 1 again we have a 0 0.5 so plus 0 0.5 and then plus again 1 plus again 1 will get and again last one is 0 0.5 now I have to add all this now 1 plus 1 is 2 1 plus 1 is 2 then 3 4 5 6 7 8 I got 8 now I have to add the 0 0.5 so 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 is 1 and again 8 plus 1 0 0.5 plus 0 0.5 is again 1 so 8 plus 1 plus 1 is 10 so for second one I got 10 here so perimeter is equal to 10 meter so this is about the second figure. Now third question they are asking here is which has a greater perimeter. You can see that for the first one we got 6 meter. For second one we got this 10 meter. So obviously the second arrangement has a more perimeter. So this will be the second arrangement. Now third question is, uh, sorry the fourth question here is Avneet wonders if there is a way of getting an even greater perimeter. Can you find a way of doing this? Now here they also given that we have we should not break the slab the slab should remain in the shape of a square it should not be uh, removed I mean that we should not break the slabs here so the arrangement is not possible this is the greatest one here so from here we can say that perimeter greater than 10 meter cannot be determined we cannot do we cannot de determine that so from here we can say the answer will be perimeter greater than 10 meter cannot be determined we cannot determine that so cannot be determined 
so that's it we have got all the answer i hope this is clear in case you have any further question or doubt you can drop a comment below thank you so much for watching